Hey guys, it's Michelle again, and today I have a kit from Dreamer Designs to unbox for you. This kit is, their picture is on the bottom of the box, so let's see, it is back to school. Do I got that right way or upside down? <laughs> okay, yeah. Um, so let's take it out of here and check it out because that's what we're here for. All right, so these boxes come with this nifty little handle on them. And I think that is really cool. So if you want to take them somewhere, you can put them back in the box and put the little, um, carry it with the little handle. So they come in these fancy bags that um, say Dreamer Designs on them and they are reusable so you can put the kit back in there when you're done with it for storage if you'd like. And the backs of the canvas are so soft. To be honest, I think the backs of these are softer than the, than the Diamond Art Clubs. I'm not saying that the kits are better, I'm just saying that the back I think is softer, which honestly, is not you're not working with the back of it so but it just is really nice okay anyway you also get this really cool little reusable bag that the toolkit comes in and i dumped it out upside down so get everything out of there i like these little bags i store my extra pens in them or you know whatever um whatever i need to in them and then, you know, the stuff is all together, not scattered all over, you know, and you can cinch it shut. And, you know, it's just a handy little bag to reuse. So we got a bag of baggies. We get two pens with Dreamer Designs. One is for um, ABs and one is just a regular pen. You get tweezers because it's a square kit. I don't know if... Dreamer Designs gives you tweezers with, I don't know if I've gotten a round kit with them or not, um, but they are branded with Dreamer Designs. They are very sharp, so keep the plastic on them. Um, you get this little separator for the tray. Well, you get these little squishies to go on your pens. They're always the white sparkly and the purple. As far as I know, I mean, I haven't bought anything in a little while, but because I have so much. Okay, I got two straight edges. I think you normally only get one, but I got two. And then you get these um, multi-placers, which I think are a three and a six placer. They don't say, but these are the fat ones. I'm not thrilled with these multi-placers, but I have so many, I just throw them away anyway. The straight edges aren't bad, they're plastic, so I mean, they bend up, chip up, whatever, just throw them away when you're done using them. But the straight edges are handy. If you don't have like a metal one, I have a metal one I use generally, and it works really well for me, so yeah. But anyway, if you're new, you might not have all that stuff. You get two patties of wax, which comes in these little jars that say Dreamer Design on, Designs on them. They are purple. They're very pretty. <laughs> they work fine. And the little tray you get with the little lip that full code comes open and you can dump your gems through there and then you close it back up. And this is a little separator so that you can have two different colors in there. Although, I'm not sure how well that'll work out when you're trying to dump the gems out. Why is that not, it's not really fitting on there quite perfectly. I don't know. Uh, there's not a certain direction to put it on or anything. I don't know. Anyway, there, I just didn't push it down all the way, I think. So if it's snug to the bottom, you know, you can have two colors in there. I'm just not sure how, how well it'll work when you're trying to dump them out. I don't know. I was really excited about it when I first seen it and then I've never really tried it, so. <laughs> Let me know if you have, if it works okay and, you know, doesn't make a big old mess all over everywhere. Okay, so the canvas comes with this purple ribbon around it and you just untie it. And 
and then we open it up and check this out. I thought this was so adorable, so cute. Okay. Oh, wow. So this kit has 78 colors. Wow. We've got two bags of drills. We have their little pamphlet. Let's look at this sticker sheet for a minute because everything on here is a sticker. I mean, just like Diamond Art Club, everything is a sticker on here. But this one's got, okay, so this Dreamer Design sticker, it's separate from this whole thing. And then this is separate. It's got the start and end date and the size and the type of drills. These each are separate stickers. And then I Love Diamond Painting there is a separate sticker. And of course, all of these are individually cut stickers so that you can put them on your, um, whatever you're kidding up into. Um, the ABs for Dreamer Designs are done a little bit differently than in Diamond Art Club. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, nine ABs in this one. Wow. That's a lot. Okay. There are 78 colors, which is a lot. Um, but that's a lot of ABs for any picture, I think. But okay. So this is the original artwork. I just thought it was a really cute picture with the little little kids sitting in front of there looking at, you know, looking in there, looking through the window. All right, so this is just a typical instruction book, how to diamond paint, dreamer designs, paint with passion is their kind of, um, you know, diamond art clubs is do what makes you sparkle, dreamer designs is paint with passion. Okay, a thank you from my, their team, the dreamer design team tips and tricks page. We've got instructions here. Um, we've got a code for a discount and their social media information on the back. So let's get rid of that and let's, oh, let me flip this canvas over for now and let it flatten out. It looks like it's doing pretty good at that. Okay. So we've got two packets of drills again. We we'll do the, this one does it too. They do it also, two dash one, rather than two dash two, rather than one of two and two of two. I don't know, it just seems silly to me that they would do it that way, but oh my. <laughs> Okay, let me check these out. All right, I'm gonna have to set this aside because it's all by itself and I will surely lose it. <laughs> so this one is an AB 3846. And look at that pretty blue AB. Oh, can you see it? There we go. I think you can see it now. All right, I'm gonna stick that right there. So I don't lose it and find an end so we can go through these. All right. So after reading them off from Dreamer or from Diamond Art Club, these I find a little more difficult to find the numbers because they actually have the number that is on here. So you've got you know one through seventy eight here, and then you've got the symbol, and then you've got the DMC code. Well, on the packet of the Dreamer Design ones, we actually have the number that is on here, also your DMC code, which on the other ones, they just have the DMC code. And the number is like bolder than the DMC code. So it just, your eyes kind of go to that number anyway. So 796, we have two bags, 762, 739, 738, 726, 721, 712, 702, and 700. Oh. All right. So we have AB963, it looks like. That's a little bit hard to read, but it's just a pale pink AB. And then we have AB 742. See, that's how they list theirs. They're not the under 150 like the, you know. So 
So that's like a, an orange AV, like a light orange. I must have them all in a row also because these are all ABs. So AB741. So there's the a little bit darker orange. And then we have an AB666, it looks like. So red. That's going to be cool. And then um, AB603. So there's another pink. And we have AB. 38, so there's a green, and an AB08, oops, something's falling out here, there's an AB falling out on my canvas, uh-oh, we don't want to lose those, we're going to lose anything, we don't want to lose those, I don't see them coming out of there though, so I don't think there's a hole or anything. All right, we have AB08, it says, which looks like white. It looks like 141. I don't know. I don't know. AB07. It's a yellow AB. And then we have 3856 and 3853. All right. So now on to 3843, we have two bags, 3827, 3826, 3799, we have three bags, that's um, like a slate gray, 3776, 3371, we have two bags, what is that, I don't know what that is. Um, oh, okay, six ninety nine, six oh five, six oh four, six oh two, six oh one, six hundred, five fifty two, five fifty, four ninety eight, and four seventy. There's another little. Must be little bits of plastic. I usually get little chunks of something falling somewhere. So, nine ninety six, two bags of nine ninety six, nine ninety five. We got two bags, nine seventy seven, nine seventy six, nine seventy five, nine forty five, and nine thirty nine. Two bags of nine thirty nine. All right. And then we have a whole nother bag to get through. Their bags are not as big as I'm used to either. I wonder how easy those are going to be back, get to get back in there. <laughs> okay. So 938, 936, 921, 920, 918, 902, 898, 890, 826, and 825. Four sixty nine, four thirty seven, four thirty six, four thirty five, four thirty four, four thirty three, four fifteen, four fourteen, four thirteen. We have two bags of four thirteen. <clears throat> My voice is kind of getting crackly. Okay, four oh two, three fifty two, three fifty one, three fifty, three twenty one. Oh, look at that red. 318, 317, 310, we have two bags, and 301, and our last string of drills, we have 823, we have three bags, 819, 815, 814, 813, 800, 797, we have two bags, so Evidently, Dreamer Designs does not go by weight because there were several with, with a couple of bags and then um, and then there were some that didn't have very many at all, so. Okay. 
let's check this canvas out. I'm excited to see where, whoop, I about threw it on the floor. I'm excited to see where all these ABs are going, are gonna be. So, hmm, let's use the Dreamer Designs ones. Not that it matters, but. <laughs> okay, so those are, these, uh, the ABs are listed at the bottom of the, of the list of colors. So, um, and they're not always just um, a whole list of numbers. So they're <laughs> a little bit tougher to find for, or to remember for me, I guess I should say, to pick them out. Um, we've got the three dots kind of in a triangle shape. We've got a circle, um, black circle on a white background, the little upside down V or, or I don't know, um, the circle that's half filled. We've got a cockeyed um, bow tie or hourglass, whatever you want to call it. An anchor symbol and capital R, the hourglass symbol, and a six. So I am no way, in no way going to remember all of those. So let's set this up here because I'm going to forget. It's easier when I'm looking for numbers. <laughs> okay, so... Let's see. The... Let me see. What am I looking for again? <laughs> okay. So there's some of these circles, which look like the white ones. There's some on this child's sock right here, this little girl. There's some in this basket right here. Um, don't know if these are supposed to be notebooks or, yeah, they look like maybe notebooks in this basket. There's some here um, and along the top of there. Okay, let's see. What else can we find? Okay, so this um, yellow with the three dots and a triangle symbol, there's quite a few on this little girl's book bag. There's some up here. There's some down here. There's a few of those white ones right there. There's some more right here and here. So there's, yeah, quite a bit of those on that little girl's book bag. And then we have, there's some more of the white on this little girl's dress up there. Okay. Well, what else are we looking for? Okay, so on this blackboard here that they're writing on, or drawing on, the little girls, um, we've got the little um, upside down V in the green right here. That's all um, ABs. Um, the circle that's half filled, they're, those are pink AB. Those are in the middle of this heart right here. Um, it looks like that's it for there. Okay, so no, why I keep wanting to say these C's are ABs, but they're not. So, okay, there's a bunch of the white along this um, this building right here, and I think let me see, I was holding this, and then I believe that's just a. Uh, a picture or a a picture there okay and then white up that flagpole um let's see we've got the cockeyed hourglass the hourglass six r anchor okay all of those still to find there's some of the r's right here so that must be like a pale orange i'm not sure what that is in there oh it's another basket okay there's another basket in here, and there's R's throughout, all throughout that. Um, so some of the ABs are in that basket. Okay, and sixes, there's a spot right here, a big old spot right there where there's sixes. Okay, so it just looks lighter right there on the picture. So that's going to be ABs, and then there's two rows of them right there. Oh, and then rows right here too. So there's a bunch of rows of them. And in between... Um, Okay, what else do we have? 
there's some more of that pink, the circle that's half filled throughout on this girl's bear there and on her book bag. And there's some more R's right there. What else? Okay, some of these hourglasses that are going cockeyed or bow tie, cockeyed bow tie, I don't know what you call them, on this boy's shoe. Those are red. I think that's a little boy, yeah. And then ours on his book bag, they're um, the light orange color on his book bag. There's some white on this little guy. Is that a kid or no, that's a dog, okay. There's white along all over on that dog. That dog is wearing a book bag. <laughs> that is adorable. I'm pretty sure that's a dog. It's got a tail. <laughs> So, um, yeah, there's some more white along here in this book here and here. Oh, let's see. I'm missing just a couple of things. The anchor and the hourglass, I think. I haven't found any yet. Okay, there's a whole bunch more of these um, cockeyed uh, hourglass or bow tie up here in the walls. Um, this back to school, the letters are all ABs. That's all the white AB. Um, the apples at the ends of them, a lot of that, I think that's apples. Looks like apple or some kind of fruit. Um, that's mostly A, B's also. I am not seeing a couple of these at all. Hmm. Okay, here we go. There's the hourglass right in here. So what is that? Looks like a thermos, okay. Like to put in a lunchbox. Looks like a thermos there. And then these might be lunch pails. Um, oh, but I don't see any in those. Looks like maybe scissors over here. Yeah. Um, I don't see anything in those either. Okay, that looks like a globe here. Oh. Okay, moving on. So a stack of books here. I still don't see that anchor symbol. I don't know if I'm just missing it or, um, oh, here's some right here. It's the darker orange. Okay, it's in that basket also. So there's gonna be a lot of ABs in that. I just didn't notice them because I noticed the R's, I guess. Um, so yeah, they're probably, um, yeah, and right here where the R's were, there's some more of those. So they're probably, yeah, right here there were some R's and there's some of the anchors right in here. So there's some right here. There's some R's there along the edge of that book and there's some anchors. So that's a lighter orange and then a darker orange oh, there. Okay, so I think we found quite a bit of it. Um, but there's a lot of ABs in this, <clears throat> excuse me, a lot of ABs in this kit. And I just think this kit is adorable. Um, so kind of like an old fashioned, um, back in the day kind of thing maybe, I don't know. I just think it's really cute though, so I had to have it. Um, so what do y'all think about this? Does anybody buy at all from Dreamer Designs? Um, I just want to remind you that I do keep a code for Dreamer Designs and the link for them in my description box. So if anybody is interested, you can get a 15% discount. If you just click on my link and it'll take you in and you use my code. It is SHELL15, C-H-E-L-L-E. -E, um, and that's all capital letters and then 15 um, it's just the last half of my name. Uh, so yeah, you can get a 15% discount. Um, so 
check it out. And um, that's all I've got for this one, guys. Um, I would love it if y'all would give me a thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, hit the subscribe button, please. It helps so much. Um, and let me know what you think about this canvas. I think, I think I am going to have to do this one soon. This one is just so gorgeous to me. And in case you haven't, you haven't seen Dreamer Designs, sorry, shaking it all over kits before, the um, symbols, well, I got a glare there. The symbols are very clear. Um, I think they're just as clear as Dream or, or as uh, Diamond Art Clubs. Um, the only problems that I have are sometimes because there are so many colors, they will have like the hourglass will be pointing. It'll be going sideways. It'll be going this way and it'll be going, you know, to the left, to the right, sideways, straight, you know. And sometimes I can forget and get them confused. So I had really got to pay attention to that kind of thing. Um, but other than that, I think that it's very clear. The symbols are very clear and very easy to read. I don't have any trouble with it. Um, don't need a light pad with them. So, okay, that's all I've got for today. I will see you in the next one. Bye guys.